Okay, guys. Uh-oh. We've already got people joining. We've just got 36, just like that. All right, guys. Now, we're here. Um, just to real quick say what we're doing. We're doing a KG knife reveal. We'll say that again in probably five minutes, give t people time to get on. But basically what we're here to do today is we got some things, okay? We got some things in this little black box here. We're going to reveal some knives, okay? Everybody, people has absolutely been loving the original KG pocket knife for here. Here it is. We'll get. We'll give other people no, that's time not to the get. Original. No, no, no. All right, that's right. This is the original. This is the original KG pocket knife here. Then we upgraded to the Gen 2 pocket knife, which is this one, which actually has KG camo. Um, uh, we call it handle. So this is our second gen. People's absolutely love these. We've sold out, I think, twice. So it's been really hard to keep these in stock, and everybody's been wanting them. So we decided we're gonna make more knives, even better than the original Gen 2. And we have them. We got them right here in this little black thing. And we're gonna reveal them to you before the day's over. You got anything to say, Avery? You got anything? Any commentary Let's on this? Show them this. This one was really cool. I thought. All right, show them that one. Show them. You know, you show. You show them. Tell them what that is. This is the oh, prototype. This is the original prototype. KG knife. It's the first one ever made. Ever made. And ever I put made. it through the ringer too. Let's see. If you can get real up close, you can uh, you can see some of the dents and dings in it. It this and since it was the original prototype, it didn't even have the KG on the little belt buckle. As you can see, the original Paga knife, which was for sale, did have this, but the original didn't even have that. And I'll let Abram close it since a lot of people may be superstitious that if you close a knife that someone else opened, you're going to die or something. I don't know, okay? Is Some people think. That's a thing. People think that. Also on the table today, <coughs> we got the filet knife. We're probably not going to do anything with that. Just uh, have that. Then we have some papers. We're going to do the paper test. <coughs> let's, uh, let's check out some of the comments. Let's see what we got. There's someone, uh, Dean, put a deer emoji. That's Pretty, wow. That's pretty epic. That's a groundbreaking, some would argue. Do you want a cookie? I do want a cookie, but this KG pocket knife we're about to reveal. KG pocket knives will cut it straight in half. I do want to say this. We're revealing knives today, not just one. We've actually got two plus six. So, and they're all different. Well, obviously they're all different. But anything else? Tell me, ask us some good questions. We're not really, we're not, we're going to try not to we're going to try not to do any like we're not we're going to try not to reveal them for, until 4 15. you okay no no okay check your phone see what time it is, it is. we're not going to try to reveal 409 we're not going to reveal anything until 4 15. that way the people who were planning on coming at 4 15 we won't short them in any way but anyways guys ask us a few questions we'll try to pick a good one or two and we'll answer them right here okay the chats are gone how many animals have you killed that's kind of a dark question. How many animals have I killed? A lot, but I don't know the exact answer. Will I be deer hunting anymore this year? Absolutely. My deer season actually doesn't end until January 31st or 30th or 29th. However many days there are in January, that's whenever it ends. Let's see, how's trapping going? Not very good at all. Not at all. We set, we set a couple traps today, but We've not been getting anything. Will you be doing a giveaway soon? I think, oh God, guys, for you 1.3 thousand people that's here, go ahead and hit the like button right now. And since y'all hit the like button, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you, we're gonna be doing a, a giveaway by the end of this video. Did you hear that? No. Did you hear that? We're doing a giveaway by the end of the video. Oh, how old am I? How old am I? <laughs> how old am I? I am 19. Okay, let's see, what else? Can you live stream a deer hunt? I'll, if y'all wanna see a live stream deer hunt, I'll do a live stream deer hunt. Go ahead and tell me right now in the chat, do you wanna see a live stream deer hunt? I wanna see this. I probably won't get to say much because if I say a lot, the deer will hear me, but let me know. Do y'all want to see a live stream deer hunt? I could probably whisper when nothing else is happening, but I think it'll do really good. Yeah, everyone's saying yes. Someone said, said me. I guess I'll take that as a yes. Let's see, um, yes. Let's see, what else we got in there? What's up? You should, you should tell them that um, we're doing the reveal at 4.15 so they don't like 
Yeah, we are going to do the first reveal at 4.15. So you guys that are already here, it's great for you guys because you ain't won't miss it. If you got any friends that planned on watching this, but maybe they're getting like, maybe they didn't realize that we might start early, you might want to go tell them that it's starting at 4.15 because at 4.15, we're going to go ahead and we're going to reveal the first knife. And we're going to be doing the paper test like I said earlier. If you're just now joining in, I'll go ahead and tell you what we're doing. If you didn't see by the title that you clicked on we're doing the kg knife reveal we've got eight knives inside this thing that we want to reveal that you guys have never before seen and also by the end of the live stream i'm going to actually make them live up on the website right now they are not on the website but as soon as this live stream's over i'm gonna go up, get on the computer make those things live so you guys can go buy them right now what is my favorite football team i don't watch football at all what about you what do you think i like uh, I like Kentucky and uh, UK is pretty good. That's where the, we live. The Lions. I like the Lions. I got UK socks on. I'll be honest. I don't watch anything UK anymore. I don't really. I don't know. I just don't watch UK. But if I had to pick, that's my thing. Here, Sarah. Someone said say Sarah. So there you go. I just said Sarah. What's your favorite movie? What's my favorite movie? Um. If I'm going to be honest, I don't have a specific movie, but I'll have to say it's the Star Wars series. Star Wars is good. Star Wars is really good. Is I that, remember is you that, used to like Indiana Jones. Though, I like so. Indiana Jones a lot. I like Indiana. Lucasfilm does basically everything right. And I'd go ahead. Jurassic Park isn't made by Lucasfilm. We'll go ahead and throw Jurassic Park in there, too. I might as... Steven Spielberg, he's close enough, okay? <laughs> he's close enough to the same guy. John Williams done the sound or whatever to all of them so it's basically the same thing where is the kg pocket katana bro <laughs> the kg pocket katana why don't we have that why don't we and i'm we still looking that. for the kg pocket flamethrower too oh yeah yeah is it time to release the first knife there was something i was going to ask two minutes two minutes, two minutes to go two minutes. oh snap two minutes. um there was something i was going to ask you guys but i literally just left my mind What's my PP bass? It's like six pounds, and I don't even think it was six pounds. It was like five and a half pounds. I've not fished in a little while, though. That's probably a bad thing. KG Pocket Grill. Bro. All right, that's what you guys need to do. It, just throw stuff at me, and we will try to make an idea out of it. Okay. Um, We got the KG Pocket Katana. We done wrote that down in our minds. Yeah. We got the KG Pocket Grill. I like it. I like it a lot. The KG, KG Pocket, Pocket Gun. Gun. I like Which that. Um, where's the KG gun? The KG pocket rocket. That, that's like... Wait. Isn't that like a thing? Is that a thing? He's going to check it out for us. KG pocket mule. The pocket mule. KG phone case. That's, that's probably a little more real. KG pocket fishing kit. That's not bad. KG lighter. KG pocket pocket. KG Hot Pocket. <laughs> KG Pocket Music Star. Okay, that's not a good thing. KG Pocket Boat. <laughs> KG Pocket Grenade. <laughs> wait, KG. Wait. It means like, well, it's like a, it's like a dirt bike. Yeah. Don't, oh well, yeah, but it's not like a. KG Pocket, does the KG Pocket knife have a steel blade? Of course, that's. It's like, yeah, it's got a steel blade. We'll show the original gen. That's the original gen, and uh, it's pretty solid. It's definitely a steel blade. It's got really good steel. It's called 9CR, really high-quality steel. Oh, here's what I, I remember what I wanted to ask you guys. Is the quality of this live stream better than it used to be on the last two live streams? I know that the last two live streams, people have been like, oh, my gosh, Kendall, uh, it looks like I'm watching a TV in underwater or something like that. But this time, it's uh, we're actually inside with Wi-Fi. So let us know. It's time. KG Pocket Shampoo. Is the, is the quality better, though? In the meantime, everyone's saying yes. Let's go ahead and open up the first one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, we need to figure out how to open this up. Okay, well. No, here we go. It goes like this. No, but you're good to do it goes it. like this, and then we raise this. Oh, okay, okay. So. Which one do you want to do first? Pull out, uh, pull out that one. This one? Yeah, that one. This is crazy. We've never done a reveal like this. We've never done a merch drop on live. 
Scoot around maybe a little bit more and we'll rotate. We've, it's stop. We're revealing it right now. KG Pocket Pistols. I'm still good with those, man. I want to pocket pistols. Here, you want to do it? You wanna do it? I'll, do the, I'll do the first one. Avery can do the first one. Are you ready? Wait, you want me to get the other one? Oh, uh, not yet. Not yet. Okay, okay. Okay, we will reveal this as soon as we can get up to 1,000 likes. Right now, we're like 848. As soon as we can get up to 1,000 likes, I will pull this thing out and we will show you. This is Abram's favorite. We've got a yeah, few different. I like this one. We have a few different variants inside. Eight different knives total. All right, we're already up to one thousand. Ready? Let's do it. Eight knives, guys. That's a lot. I, I'm I'm really I'm really surprised. He's really. I'm really surprised by how cool these knives are too. They're actually they're really, really cool. Nice. They're really cool. They're really nice. Listen, I'm just. They're be, they're nicer than the original Gen Two, the orange one. You think it is nicer? I think I think nice. it's I like it a lot, babe. It, it's I mean it's basically the same knife, but it looks a lot cleaner. It looks yeah. nice. The knife for this first variant. We're gonna say this. Two different types of knives, okay? Um the first knife is this one right here. It is very similar to the original Gen 2, except we decided to go with a little bit different camo. This is actually the KG Aqua camo. No, it's not the Aqua Camo. It's the Blue Tigers Camo. So whenever you go online and you you look up for this knife, you're gonna go. You're wanna. You're wanna. You're wanna gonna look up the KG Gen Two Single Blade Pocket Knife. And then there's actually gonna have an option for three different colors. One's gonna be the Blue Tigers. That's this one. The other one is going to be Orange Tigress, which is this one. And the third one's going to be in here, which we're not going to show just yet. Yeah, sure. Not yet, but we're just letting them get a, get a little bit of it. Quick outre, I guess. But that's just that's just clean, guys. That's clean. That's a nice knife. Let's do the paper test on them. Actually, since the, other part, since the other knife in here is so similar, we will go ahead and uh, pull it out too. Since Valentine's Day is coming up, listen, I want to say this. I probably just gave it away. Yeah. <laughs> but <laughs> we posted a picture on Instagram. I don't have it, but if this wasn't a live stream, I'd pop it up right here. I left I left a little piece of one of the colors out, and it is this one right here. It is pink. I know uh, I have a few girls watching me. Maybe not much, but I'm going to be honest. I'm a boy. I, you know that, though, hopefully. But this is my favorite. So we, we brought out what? <laughs> <laughs> this is weird. We, we brung out Abram's favorite and my favorite. The blue and the pink. It's Valentine's Day's, I don't know, what, four one, or five months away? One month. One month. Okay, that's one pretty month, soon. exactly. So, um, this, one's, this one's perfect timing. I mean, if you order it now, you'll definitely get it by Valentine's Day. Here's the catch, though. These are both the same knives. Basically, the only thing is they have different skins. One has blue, blue tigress. One has pink tigress. Here's the thing, guys. Here's the thing about these two that are going to be a way different than the rest that are in here. See, here's two. There's six more in here. These two are different, though. These are extremely limited. There's only, like, there's only 95 of each of these. Now, of course, if everyone likes them, we will restock them. However, I won't, I'll tell you, the restocking dates for these will be very far down the road, like at least three months. So there's only 95 of 96 of each of these. And uh, once they're gone, they're gonna be gone for a really long time. So if you like the blue, here's the blue. If you like the uh, pink, here's the pink. There's only 95 of each. Extremely limited for at least, at least a couple months anyways. We're gonna go ahead and lay those right here. Also, I want y'all to go on. Any questions about these particular knives, ask us now. And then after we get done with showcasing these, we'll move on to these right here. Let's see. We'll give y'all time for the live stream to catch up. Ooh, a KG pocket swimming pool. That was a good one. You should tell them about the uh, the, the giveaway you were talking about earlier. The giveaway? Yeah, because you like said it like before 415. Oh, yeah. We're also doing a giveaway at the end of this video. So stick around. We're Since this is a knife thing, I'm pretty sure we're going to give away a knife. So I don't think we're probably not going to give away one of the limited editions since there's literally only 96 a piece. But one of these in here... We will do it. So, any questions about these knives right here? Go ahead and ask us. And since we're right here, basically customer support, we can we can answer your questions. Besides that, what's your you got anything you really like about these two knives? Me? Yeah, I like how it's clean. I mean, 
I helped make the camera. I like that. I, I like the camera. Abram did help make out. I mean, yeah, Abram did help make the KG camo. Like this is KG camo, but this is this is even more in depth KG camo. We made the pattern ourselves. If you look in close, a lot of people have been finding the secret uh, KGs and AMs in this knife. And I, did, I don't even know if I told y'all about, about it, but there's actually KG and AM watermarks in these knives and also in the orange knife. If you have that, you can go look at it and try to find them. But it's almost like a Where's Waldo type thing where you're uh, where you're looking for the KGs. Let's see. We'll come in here. Someone left us a 20 Kenner Herring left a $25 super chat. That's, that's a lot of money, guys. And, uh, oh, I guess one thing we can say is that these knives are here. There's only 95 of each. I said that probably, let me look at my watch, eight times already. But they're only going to be, they're going to be the same price as the original Gen 2, which is $29.99. So you get a whole, whole new, basically a whole new knife here, upgraded, different, a tigress color, blue or purple, I mean, pink, for the same price as the original Gen 2. Now, I'm sorry I didn't get to at. I, I didn't get to read any of those questions, but uh, go, oh, we can do that. Tell me, uh, one person said, "What's the steel? It is nine CR. There's something more than nine CR after that, but that's all I can remember. All I know is it's really high quality. I will say this: everyone, like literally everybody who's tried out one of these knives, absolutely loves it and is over impressed. How do you say that? Like they're not under impressed; they're over, they're impressed. I guess. I want y'all to do this right now. Which one's your favorite, pink or the blue? I'll hold them up for them right now. Well, I want to take a little bit of a, a little bit of a survey for you. One point three thousand, no, one point seven thousand people's here. Pink or blue? Pink or blue? We're gonna try to. Some person said blue. Let's say person said pink. I'll try to read them off as fast as I can. Both. Blue, blue, blue. Uh, blue, blue, blue. Both pink, pink. Sheba. Okay. <laughs> blue, pink, blue, blue, pink. Pink, blue. It's honestly even. Do you think so? Roughly even. One person said, um, how much are they? It's going to be $29.99 for these. Yeah, the same price as the original Gen 2. Now do you want to move on to some of these? See, I'm looking at the I'm looking at the chat, and literally blue pink is just about even. Maybe a few more people likes blue. Personally, I like the blue too, but I like the pink too. I think it's so different. Not many. There's not many pink knives out there. Not many blue knives out there either, but are you ready to go ahead and... What time is it? All right. If we can get up to 1.5 thousand likes, we will go ahead and release the next knife. Right now, we're sitting at 1.4K. So, 1.5, we'll go ahead and pull out another one. That one said that these are the blue is Thomas approved. So, that, Thomas that means... Approved. Nice. I've had a few videos that are Thomas approved. There we go. 1.5. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you want... I'm the main item right here. One, two, three, four, five, or six first wait um, do you think we should do reveal in order of one two three or one two three four five six i think or make, one two three four five six should we go one two three four five six or one two three four uh, five six i think we should do this way because these are the same style even though they're different colors right they are the same styles these are also the same styles different colors we're definitely not giving <laughs> spoiling it but they get the point this is you're watching us think. Let's so, do these three first. All right, let's pull them out all at you, once. You showed me these three first, huh? You showed me these three first, and you liked them. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Do we do them all at once or what? One at a time. Yeah, yeah. All One right. at a time. We, okay. One at a time. Do this all right. one first. All right. Here we go, guys. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, this is so different. This is so different than y'all have ever seen before. Like usually, you've seen the single blade. But we have branched out. We have branched out to a different, all kinds of different type of knife. I call this, this is kind of like a traditional knife, like a case knife. Not saying these are a case knife, but they're the same style. They're not a single blade tactical locking blade. These are more old man, not even old man, but you slide it in your pocket. This is super small. This in here is a Stockman style. If you guys know a lot about knife styles, this is a Stockman. It has three blades right there. One right here, one sharp, thin one right there, and then another pretty solid one right there. We got the KG stamped right there on the, uh, the little seal, or not really the, the seal, but what would you call that? That little thing right there? Stamp? It's, yeah. it's yeah, I guess. It's like a, 
a circular logo. But then, I don't know if y'all can tell, Big Blade right here also has stamped, engraved, whatever you'd like to call it. I believe it's stamped, but a stamped KJ, KG in the blade. You can notice the color there. That is actually uh, brown. And here's the thing. It's real ox bone. It's not synthetic plastic. It's not fake. It is real ox bone. And it's been colored to where it's not pure white, but it gives you just that little bit of brown color. I'm really excited about this knife. I really like this. A lot of people will prefer this as an everyday carry knife over something like this because we will show you the difference in size. We got this one and then we got this one. See, almost like double, maybe triple the size if in surface area completely, but this is super great everyday carry. All these are super great everyday carry, but they're also super useful too. Most of the time you're not gonna need to like defend yourself with a knife which is this probably mm, strong suit? I don't know, but this is a great everyday carry knife. There's something hanging off your pants, you can cut it off. This is the knife that you need to cut stuff off your pants. We're moving on to our next one. Uh, we said that this one was kind of like, uh, this one was dyed to give it the brown color. This one was not dyed, okay? This is just straight ox bone. Not dyed, it's like white with a little bit of yellow and black on the inside. That's solid. Same style, which is a Stockman. Stockman style, three blades, stamped on the inside, 9CR steel, so still super solid steel. Again, it's just it's just solid. It's a little bit of a different design. Like, you think like, so? Yeah, well, I mean, like... What do you mean, design? Like, here, look at this. Okay. Like, look, it's like... See? See what I'm talking about? Like, it's not the, like the same thing. This cuts? Yeah. Oh, yeah, the same cuts. Yeah. I mean, different cuts. This one has longer cuts. Like, it, the cuts go from here all the way down. This one's more like smaller, multiple cuts, like this is more like if that made any sense at all. Now we're gonna pull out one more. Hope y'all are excited about this. This one's my favorite material. Still going with the same Stockman style three blade. This one's different. This one's black. This one is not ox bone. This one is ox horn. I don't know if you look, know what ox looks like, but if it was standing there, it could probably go through the wall. It's a big thing. It's like an Asian cow, okay? But this one's an ox ox horn. This one's probably, like, big time my favorite handle. And instead of being... This one's like... Some of y'all understand that. Some of y'all may not, which is okay, too. But same style. Also, on the website, as soon as this live stream is over... You can go check it out on the website. You can get in-depth pictures. Any questions for these style knives right here? We got three Somebody more. Somebody said how much are they? Oh, uh, these are these are actually also going to be twenty nine ninety nine. So the same price as the KG Gen two pocket knives, or these right here. It's basically like whatever you want. We got it for the same price. Let's see. Anything? I saw one question. Something was like, um, okay, are the are the stockmans sharper than the? Pocket knives. That's a great question. Why didn't we? Do, why did? How did we forget the paper cuts? Oh, yeah. All right, we'll go ahead and pull out the brown bone. Um, I hope y'all can see this. We'll pull out the old blue. Ready? Yes. Okay, we're just going to go straight down paper test. Maybe angle it this way a little bit more for these yeah. guys. Right. We'll do one more. Right through here. We'll get the blade started. Well, that's. That's super sharp. I don't know if we're going to be able to tell how much sharp. Well, yeah, here we yeah, go. Do it. Wait. Okay, yeah. Then we'll do the little stabbing technique. Wait, I should do it like this so I'm not, like, pulling it. See? You don't think you should Cause pull I, it? Yeah, because if you pull it, it's easier to cut. So this is, like, if I do it like this, it's, like, it's showing that it's, like, wait. <laughs> okay, there you go. go. There you go. Anyways, right. now we're going to uh, close that one. See, I mean, they're both they're both razor sharp, and I've not had them that long, and I've already cut myself with both of them. So, yeah, get that other paper. And now we're going to do the sharpness test, the paper test on this one. Now, there's three blades. I'm about positive they're all about the same sharpness. We'll go ahead and cut this one the same way. Super sharp. Yeah, it's like, it's pretty sharp. We're going to get started. You just cut straight down like that. We'll do one more. Well, yeah, pull out that last one. We'll do it long ways. Hold it just like that, long ways. So, are the Stockmans sharper than the KG pocket knives? Not that we can tell with paper. I mean, 
Sharpness, I'll say this is this is probably sharper. This is probably better for fine stuff, like small, maybe whittling. This is better for big stuff. Abram watched me. Probably a bad idea. I cut I cut I cut down a tree with this. It was like that big. It took me a little while, but how this is so much thicker blade, it's like a it's like a solid blade. It worked through it and it's still a viable knife. Like it still works. This one probably can't cut down a tree, but it's got three small blades. You can really get in there and do some really tight stuff. Maybe even take a screw. My dad does this. He takes a he uses it the blade as a screwdriver because it's so small and comes to like a it's also probably a really bad idea for your knives but as for uh, which one's sharper i think they're both razor sharp if not sharper but they're both about the same that one's obviously got the thicker blades let's see someone said spam turkey hunting well don't spam it okay wait i got we're gonna do some turkey hunting sometime in the spring but don't where do y'all lean chimp month i, I don't know what that means. yes Let's go ahead and pull out the rest of these? Not yet. Let's see if we got any let's see if we got any more questions on, about these. How do they close? Okay, good idea. This one um, opens up. You may be familiar with it from my videos. It opens and it locks. Okay, that's one big step. It locks. It has a locking mechanism. For this one, you come in, push that down, and then you do that. That's why this is probably better for like intense stuff. This one, however, when you come in there, you open up the blades. It does not lock. It has no locking mechanism. It has like a it has like a top spring to where it's not it's not floppy at all. You can't just tap it and it close, but it doesn't have a specific locking mechanism to shut it. You kind of just put force on it and it closes like that. But no real locking mechanism. Just like every other stockman knife of this style, you may have one. You may have your dad has one. Someone may have one laying around. It's same as every other stockman. But these don't lock. That one locks, but because they don't lock, that's not a bad thing at all. Let's see. Can you skin big game with them? Of course. Absolutely. They're razor sharp, especially with this. these, how they have smaller blades. Like something for a squirrel, you can really get in there and go around the legs and stuff like that. So this right here, is it assisted? Neither one of them are assisted, like spring assisted. This one is like, it's not a spring assisted, but the weight balance makes it really solid to just whack up but it's not going to fly open it's not spring assisted so it's not like illegal anywhere but it's pretty quick to just pull right open kg machete oh never mind i thought a machete was an axe we do have a kg hatchet that's really sharp too we it, could do a kg machete we could do a kg machete that'd be cool that would be I really would cool it. in my opinion in inside kg's mind why is kg not going to do a kg ma machete I think because a machete is mainly for like chopping down saplings in a way. I feel like the KG hatchet already fills that void that's needed. So we don't want to be too redundant. We don't just want to make stuff for no reason. If since we already have something that can do the same, that can be do the same, I don't know, do the same workload. I guess we're going to go ahead and not really make a hat, I mean, machete because we have a hatchet. Some person said, "Wait, mm, these come in. I think they're like four point five ounces. These come in." at least half try them out there's no real way to tell them right now i've not weighed them just yet but almost half see it's a lot about, I, the, same. about the same about like, half yeah so yeah these little stogmans they're about half the weight so they're super good for everyday carry that's why a lot of people who have knobs decide to carry something every day like this rather than something every day carry like this we still got three more okay let's see what we got Go get the new knife, knife, no. Do what now? Made in, let's see, what's that say? How much is the Stockman cost? It's going to cost $39.99. Go to get the new KG knife now. Oh, okay, he wants us to get out of the, uh oh. What? You, you Almost. turned it sideways. Yeah. Okay. All right, check out the new chats. KG sandals. Not yet. Not yet. Ooh. Uh, what's my favorite merch? The knives. Not even kidding, guys. They are my favorite. I mean, this is pretty great. This is SSOG. I think from statistics, this may be the number one best-selling thing. The KG Pocket Knives right there behind it. Pretty close, too. And we've not been selling these nearly as long. So, for the last, for like, if you condense it down, percentage of time, 
This is the most popular item for good reason, because I think it's the best. I really do. KG Rock. That's a good one. Bruh. That'd be cheap to manufacture. Yeah, it would. <laughs> Make a lot of profit. KG Crocs with laces. That would be interesting. <laughs> Anyways, how strong is it? Pretty strong. Super cut down strong. A tree with it. Yeah, I cut down a tree with it. So that's pretty strong. Let's see. I think we're gonna go ahead and open up the rest. We'll pull my all at the same time. This, this one? Yeah. It's the same time? No, wait, wait, wait. What? Do this one. They're all basically the same. If they've seen no, they've seen these, except Whenever I um, uh, wanted to make a pocket knife like this, I wanted to go with the two biggest styles. So, I mean, y'all may already see it coming. It is the Trapper style. Now, we have the same three colors. We have the brown ox bone, the white ox bone, and then we actually have the black ox horn. But they're all three the same materials as these. Now, let me go ahead and pull one of them out and show you the, actually, the actual design of the KG Trapper knife. Now, instead of being a three blade, this one actually comes in and has two blades, which some people may not need three blades. They may only want two. That right there is what we're looking at. Still got the same crispy bone handle. Got the stamped KG blade right there. Super shiny, stainless steel. There they are. We'll do the we'll do the sharp test on these two. Either even since they're they're about the same sharpness, I would guess, as the other ones. How much? Same thing, $29.99. Same price for all the knives. I could go up on these, but I was like, I don't want to go up anymore because I want to give you all a deal. I don't want to make y'all pay a lot for something. <laughs> Let's paper test it. Pick a blade, Avery. Pick a blade. No, I'll let y'all pick a blade. One or two. Pick one or two. Pick a blade. One or two. One or two. The first, the fifth one that we see is the one we're going to cut with. I'm not telling you which blade's which. Two. All right, one. Uh, two, one, uh, two. All right, we're using the second blade. We're actually cutting with the thicker blade of the trapper knife. This one right here is number two. Ready? Mm. All right, let's see what we got. Cuts like butter. Well, cuts like a hot knife through butter. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine cuts, cutting something with butter. Cut something with butter. I don't know how good that would work out. Someone said, say, Kaylin. Well, Kaylin. That one says zero. That's an mm. interesting topic. Okay, try it. Wait, 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 let me try. Okay. Cut with zero. That's pretty sharp, too. We wasn't even using a blade. It works like, I mean, it's like not even, no blade. No blade Perfect. at all. Steel toe Crocs. Look at that. Clean, 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 cut right there. clean cut with the zero blade. Oh, man. Look at perfect straight line perfect straight line yeah not even using a blade <laughs> but i mean any more questions guys that's uh this is all the knife reveals we can try to get y'all a closer look if you'd like that kg pocket tactical nail cutters so someone i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna try grab y'all oh someone southern hunter and outdoors said ten dollars all right i'm gonna try pull you off the tripod without revealing oh we never said that Okay, so uh, y'all see this? How there's only 95, they're like super limited edition. We've got six more colors of these that we are not showing you today because they're going to be released on down the road. So maybe like a month or two, maybe probably not even a month, we're going to be releasing two more colors of these that are going to be semi-coordinated. You'll see whenever they get there, but we're going to be doing those on the live stream too. Now, how do I do this? without spoiling them because they're sitting right there on the table uh-oh all right i think we're good now we can show them off a little bit better that is it from the front screen the pink mm. it's a little more vibrant than the live stream says but it's still pretty epic guys then here is the blue right cheer that looks nice that, it, that looks nice. Someone said, where is Miami? It's actually in Florida. I don't know if they're talking about Miami or Miami, but one's in Florida, one's asleep. <laughs> There's those two. Let's check out the closer uh, colors of these. Oh, yeah, these look really nice. One, says, one person said the KG throw enough. I want y'all to do one thing. These are excellent throwing knives, aren't they? Like, if you don't believe me, go back and look up. It's a video on YouTube that I made. It's called um, Will It Throwing Knife? We, do, we check out all kinds of random stuff and see, will it throw a knife? We did it with this one. 
Yeah, we did it with that one, but it's still the Gen 2, so these are really good throwing knives. They work actually. They, they're very similar knives. But they work basically the same. But here, we'll give you one more closer look. If y'all want to see anything particular, like maybe y'all want to see a blade or something, tell me in the comments and, uh, well, the chat thing. And uh, can you sing the limited, what? Can you sign the limited edition ones? Yeah, if you uh, buy a limited edition one and then, like, leave in the notes, say, can Kindle sign this? I can sign it. Yeah, definitely. Just whenever you go buy it in the, in the notes of the order, um say can kindle sign this and i can definitely go in there and i can definitely sign it right there Which on the handle that? yeah i can i can i would sign these i can probably sign the box on these but i don't know there's not really a way to sign this knife uh kg butterfly knife probably not how much would you sell peanut for all right guys um uh i don't know what to say you can have him <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh but uh yep when you go on the site, we're probably about to end this. Um, we're about to end the live stream, but don't leave yet because we still have the giveaway. Yeah, someone, Aiden, Aiden Lamfin, he just reminded me about the giveaway, so thanks for that. Don't leave yet, but we're going to do the giveaway in like three seconds. Here's what we're going to look at. This right here, whenever you go on the website, it's going to be called the KG Gen 2 Single Blade Pocket Knife. This is the color pink tigress. This is the color blue tigress. Whenever you go on there looking for this, you're going to go on KG uh trapper pocket knife then for colors you're gonna see this one right here this is the brown ox bone this is the white ox bone this is the black ox um uh, ox horn same for these the colors align perfectly now for the giveaway since we're doing the giveaway oh oh gosh i almost revealed something i should for the giveaway i'm gonna ask you guys to go down or not really go down anywhere but abram well I can probably screenshot. Here's what we're going to do. The rules are kind of sketchy, but they're not sketchy. Oh, oh no. I'm trying not to reveal anything because right here is the... I'm going to hide these before I mess up. Yeah. I'm going to hide those before I mess it up. But All right, here's what I need y'all to do. For the giveaway, get in the chat. Pick out which one of these you want and your Instagram handle. Now we have the Trapper and the Stockman, and I held up the wrong ones, but we have the Stockman, we have the Stockman three blade, Trapper two blade. Tell me which one you want and what color. We got black, white, brown. Tell me what you got and your Instagram handle. Just like that, if you don't have Instagram, that's okay. Um, just tell me which one you want and we can go from there. I can probably find you on YouTube. But if you do have an Instagram, go ahead and tell me like that. Tell me the, the style, which is Trapper Stockman, and the uh, and the color, and your Instagram handle. If you don't have that, that's okay. But here we go. I'm going to try to screenshot one, and then I'll be getting up with you whenever you show me. All right, there's one. The first one looks like American Patriot. He's got one. He's getting the Stockman in black. So, And then we're going to do... Oh, there's another one. Uh, We'll wait a second. Sorry. Um, we're going to keep going. We're going to wait about... Keep spamming it, guys. You might as well spam it. If you don't... Let's, wait, let's wait a few seconds. All right, all right. Abram called it. We're going to wait a few minutes. We're going to wait a few we're seconds gonna, at least. We're going to do it when my when my timer goes off. All right, how long's your timer? I'm not going to say because then it'll... That'll and how long? Is it under a minute? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'll all right. This, Abram's got... many seconds. All right, so keep spamming it. And whenever whenever his timer goes off, which is really soon... Wait, actually reset it because they haven't okay. heard it yet. It's got okay. on delay. Start spamming it. Abram's got a really short timer on it. Go ahead. Once we see the spamming start happening, we'll start the timer. And whenever his timer goes off, we're just going to take a screenshot and give it to somebody. So uh, go ahead and start spamming. Start it now. All right, start spamming it, guys. Go ahead and spam it with your, with your Instagram handle if you have one. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Let's see what we got. All right, there we go. Looks like we got Devin Kirkwood. He wants the Stockman in the Oxhorn, which is the black. So it seems like both the people wanted the black. That's really nice. So there we go, guys. We just gave away two knives. We're giving away another one. Uh, yeah, sure. Okay, let's do Keep one spamming, more. guys. We'll give away three one, knives. That's, one more. That is a $60 value. Tucker Phipps said, yes, sir. All right, here we go. It's about to it's about to go. So, this is a forty minute live stream. 
Let's see what we got, 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 what we got. Oh man! Who is that? That is Multi Gaming Sweden. He actually got a Trapper Black knife. So we've given away two of the Trapper Blacks and um, one of the Stockman Blacks. Sounds like they like the black. I think they like the black too. If I'm going to be honest, that's my favorite too. Whenever I chose one to carry, which it's right here in my pocket, um, I, I picked out the black. I picked out the black. This is the one I carry. I picked out the black Trapper too. So there we go, guys. We just did three giveaways. That one guy, his name was in Sweden. If it is Sweden, um, I don't know how the customs work, but we'll try to figure it out if you are from Sweden. But uh, anyways, guys, thanks for joining us here on the live stream. We're going to call it a day. Oh, yeah. I'm going to run upstairs right now. And as soon as I run upstairs, oh, that's my hand. As soon as I run upstairs, I'm going to turn on these things to where y'all can buy them. So within the next five minutes, they should be up. Yeah, if you want to, your best chance is probably just go uh, refresh, 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 because there's only 95 of these, 95 of the blue, and there's quite a lot of these, but there's not an unlimited amount, so these actually may run out still, run out too. <clears throat> um, bye, guys. I'm going to run up there. Go ahead. Check it out. KendallGrade1.com slash shop. They should be in there pretty soon. They should be available. Uh, bye.